What's going on all you gamers? Here we are in Cyberpunk 2077 and today I'm going to be going over why you should definitely, definitely pay off your debt to Victor. So if you want to see that, then stay tuned. That's coming up next. Welcome back all you guys and girls. So yeah, I don't know if you're at the start of the game, the mid of the game, end game, wherever you are, there is a good chance they're going to want to pay off Victor. Now, unless you found some absolutely ridiculously good mods, I will show you why you should pay off Victor. As soon as I remember where Victor is. And I've walked straight past him. Right, so... Through here. Aha! So here we are, and we're at this Ripper Docks. And this is your pal Victor. Now, if you have a little look, if I press on that, I can go straight into it and kind of buy whatever I want. I was thinking about swapping some chrome. You got any new toys? Now, early on in the game, this isn't the case. You owe him kind of like a lot of money. I can't remember exactly where it is. I think it's around the 20,000 mark. It might be 21,000. So at the start, it might seem like you should just go to other Ripper docks because why not, eh? They're definitely going to have some good stuff anyway. And to be perfectly honest, he does sell some good stuff, but I found a lot better in other places. So why would you want to actually pay him back well here's the thing his actual mods here aren't the best they're really not this one is good very very good again i'm not sure if it's the best i think it's probably got the longest on its actual um its slow time effect 25 percent for 16 seconds that's really long i myself wouldn't pick this variant so if I'm not picking any of them, why would you pick it? Well, another one he's got, he's got this smart link here. I've purchased that, I wanted it, it's really good. I've heard there's a workaround for this through one of the side quests. So again, if you can get that somewhere else, you might not want it from him either. So why do you want to pay back the money? Pure and simple, if you press RB, and if you have a little look over here, he says, he says, he sells crafting spec, traje trajectory analysis. Now, these are an actually pretty good. They're really good if you're going for kind of a ballistic build, a rebound build, that kind of thing, with the uh, power damage, I believe. But more so, you're after this bad boy right here, which I believe is almost definitely probably one of the best cyberware mods if not the best for damage in the entire game increase headshot bonus damage by 50 percent that is absolutely ridiculous that is absolutely ridiculous in some builds especially builds that kind of head towards if i show you here especially builds that head towards more more so the reflexes side maybe a bit of crit from cool but not going the whole stealthy stealthy way it's gonna do a lot of damage if you're into your kind of um gun fights as such it really will i think it's probably one of the best mods in the game so pay victor back and then go straight to here press trade and pick yourself up this mod for twenty thousand. If you're worried about money, I've got a guide on how to make quite a bit of money. I'm going to have a little look, apparently there's a few more out. But trust me, guys, girls, gamers, pay them back, go get this mod. As far as I'm aware, it chucks into your eye socket, so make sure you've got a really nice eye socket one on. But it's well worth doing. Right, all you gamers, I've just picked that up because, well, like I said, you want it. <laughs> so as always i hope that's helped some of you out if it has then want to hit that subscribe and bell icon come part of the sofa squad for all things gaming for all things xbox and for all things fun as always take care i'll see you on next day